What's up ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel and for today's video we have a very cool special unboxing coming. It's gonna be, I don't know if you've ever seen on YouTube those ads for mystery boxes, you just buy one and it shows you, usually you know it comes with, there's a picture of a beautiful resin statue such as these. And as if you've seen other videos on the channel, I love purchasing these, I'm a big collector. And so definitely it's something that I know a lot and I know what they cost usually. And on those ads, you always see it's about like 10, $15 to get a mystery box. And well, if you ever wondered what you would get in those, well, we're gonna find out today. I did just that. I went ahead on the ad. The one that I have seen personally, it was called Jerji. I'm gonna put a link down in the description of the video so you're gonna be able to see. And it's definitely the same thing. They're all the same. You see videos like these big, beautiful resin statue like that it's telling you, you have a chance to get that on $10, but I mean, come on, it's just personally, I was never expecting to get something like that, but we're gonna see exactly what we get. Uh, usually, thankfully, personally, I went ahead and paid with PayPal for this because you know, PayPal, you always get great protection. If ever they don't send you what was described or something's wrong, PayPal is great for that. <laughs> and you're gonna see, I'm definitely glad I did because here, I purchased, there was supposed to receive about 10 figures. There's supposed to be four Naruto, one Dragon Ball, one Pokemon, two Demon Slayer, and one of One Piece, if I remember correctly. So about 10 figures total. They were having like a bunch of sales. They were saying like buy more, more sales. And at the end of the day, it came to about $120 shipped to me for everything, 10. So about $12 a pop for each. And here they finally arrived. This is what <laughs> we've received. So, I mean, as you can see, it's just impossible. Just look at the size <laughs> of what I've received compared to just one resin statue that they display on their ads. It's just hilarious, personally. And then on the back, it's just, it's not even the same amount. What is written here for the description of what they've sent there was only seven in total and it doesn't even mention anything about the dragon ball one so <laughs> definitely this is gonna be something very very hilarious i can't wait to see what is actually inside this thing because the, i mean just, we're gonna see let's we've talked enough about it let's go ahead without any other delay let's find out exactly what we have inside this little mystery box and there we have it folks this is the package again that was supposed to have 10 10 figures like one of the rengoku that i've showed you just before oh my god this is this is amazing let's go ahead and get this open we're gonna see exactly what is in there I mean, just starting here, look at this. Like, the box is just destroyed. This is incredible. This is insane. You just stacked a bunch of shit inside this. This is. You just took some random box and stacked a bunch of shit inside of it. This is insane, man. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. This is incredible. And another, <laughs> the same, another Demon Slayer box with Tanjiro for some reason. And it stacked a bunch of random shit in there. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and take everything out. Let's see what we... <laughs> Here we have it, everything. This is amazing. I mean, to be honest with you guys, I wasn't even expecting to receive anything. I'm even surprised that something showed up at all. So let's see what this is all about. 
Let's just go ahead and take a look at this master ball. I mean, it's just a ridiculously cheap plastic. <laughs> With a little brown oddish in there for some reason. <laughs> this is insane. He looks like nothing. This is incredible. Even the inside of the master ball is just like a dirty. It looks like crap. It's terrible. Oh my god, this is just so, so bad. Wow. Very, very cheap figure. Small. Plastic paint job is just messy. Smudge, big smudge here on the clothes. Here on his paint in his pants, there's just smudges there. Very, very low quality. And bro, like what the fuck is happening with his chest here? Like his neck, it's just horrible, like. What the fuck? This is crazy. He looks like shit. And that face, damn, pro, poor Rolly. Just got bastardized here. This is terrible, terrible. This is one of the one piece that we got. This is <laughs> cool. It's just oh my god. It's insane how it looks like shit. A tiny, ridiculous, minuscule piece of shit. Wow, this is incredible. The balls. <laughs> the balls on them to have these ads i love it this is insane <laughs>looks like it's the naruto mystery bag from what i purchased there was supposed to be like it said it's four figures of naruto so i'm guessing this is the lucky bag they were talking about this is terrible like what this is so bad Wow. I'm amazed by how bad it is. It's incredible. Behind the head, like there's a bunch of smudges and traces of paint. The paint job is just terrible. I've never seen something so bad. Wow. so bad and there are like smudges of paint like everyone his hand is just a black smudge here and here like what what is this supposed to be at least the little base actually says his name properly. Naruto is actually spelled properly, so I guess that's that, you know? Could have wrote in like, who knows, Nayuta or Neta or anything really. Like, wow, the eyes on Kurama look like nothing. It's just so bad.
now. I mean, the mouth on Kurama is just terrible. The eye is just like a smudge, not even properly placed. It's it's so bad. That mouth. It's terrible. Wow. Does he even have nine tails? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right. At least he does actually have nine tails. Just tiny little shit, man. Wow. Wow. And like they can't even get the get it right. The hair looks like like why is there a smudge on the top of the hair? Why? Wow. I mean honestly I don't even know what I'm gonna do with these, to be completely honest with you guys. Wow, 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 wow. Again, hair is just messed up. It looks terrible. Orochimaru's face looks like nothing. It looks like nothing. And I mean, poor Amanda, he's just like, wow, this is, this is so bad. Wow, 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 wow. Wow, so this right here, this is the Naruto mystery bag, lucky gift bag. This is it, right here, man. And they show you the big beautiful Naruto resin, Hokage Naruto, some from LX Studios, they show you those Rasengan, Naruto, action poses, some bunch of dynamic poses, they show you the Susanos, all crazy epic pieces, but this is what we're gonna get at the end of the day. This is the Naruto mystery bag, lucky bag. All right. So we did get the Naruto mystery bag, that's okay. Now these are the two One Piece mystery gifts. Again, most of them, like, it's always those big statues, some big resin, you have the big Gear Fort Luffy, beautiful pieces, and right here, this is what we received. Let's take quick measurements, I'm curious. This, this is just... It's barely two inches. 2.5, not even. Wow, 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 wow. Next, so we did get the Dragon Ball mystery gift again. I mean, it's just this little piece of shit. Not even sure what I'm gonna do with it. His chest is just, ugh, looks terrible. Weird bump in his chest or whatever, I and mean, looks so bad. The hair is so poorly done. There are like cracks on it, the paint is just peeling away. It's bad, it's bad, it's bad. And I mean you see it there, but it's even worse in person. I'm telling you, it's oh, it's bad, it's bad, it's bad. And then I mean this. Wow, this was just an absolute joke. I mean, come on, this little brown oddish. He looks like nothing. Poor little guy. Wow, this is insane. So we did get the two One Piece figures. We did get the Naruto Lucky Bag. 
we did get the Dragon Ball and we did get the Pokemon. Last but not least is the two Demon Slayer. And I mean, they are exactly the same from what I can see. And it appears to be they just, all they did is just, you know, they took the box, it was probably, you know, Tanjiro came in this box and they opened it, stacked a bunch of other little shits in there and told you, here, there you go, bro. Here's your, here's your mystery box, here's your surprise. And they just opened that toy and then stacked a bunch of shit in there, man. That, that's legit, that's all they did. This is incredible. It's definitely got a very bad plastic smell coming from it. That first part, I mean, it's, it's the best out of the lot, but it's still very bad. Paint job is very poor. There's a bunch of smudges everywhere. I mean, it's very, very, very bad. Tanjiro's expression, yeah, it just looks like shit. And his hair is just smudges on it. It just, ugh, it's, it's bad, it's bad, people. It's really, really bad. Same thing, just the feel is just very, very cheap material used. And that belt, I think it's just moving, it's even properly glued there. It's, it's, it's very bad. This is very bad. Wow. The smudges on it. It's, it's just terrible. This is it. That's the Tanjiro, that's the mystery. Demon Slayer, they probably have only this one that they just grab the box, that little box and just stash a bunch of shit in there and that's just pretty much what they get you, man. So if you've ever wondered what you're gonna get from all those websites, mystery boxes telling you, hey, look at those big, beautiful resins, you're not getting that. This is what we're receiving. Very, very poor quality items but to be honest with you guys I just I was never expecting to get something like an actual resin statue that's why I just take a sword and I mean look at this it's bent it's ugly it just it looks like nothing really 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 bad and uh, here he has it like that and I mean it holds but it's really 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 bad it's so ugly Barely, barely holds together. The exact same figure. They just sent us two of them. And this the second one is even worse. Like ugh, straight on the hair on his face, there's just like there's just a massive smudge on his hair here. It's it's terrible. This is just so, so bad. Wow, 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 wow. So definitely extremely glad that we paid with PayPal because uh, 
I mean, this is it. Why is that advertised? So, again, just to show you, this is what they advertise on their website. You will get big, beautiful resin statue like this, high quality product, and at the end of the day, this is a little piece of shit that you get. It's sure I can I can tell it's Tanjiro, but it looks like crap compared to Rengoku right here. You know, just night and day, the quality, just the feel when you're touching it. It's yeah, it's just night and day. Like seriously, there's not much I can say about these. I think the product speak for themselves. Very, very poor quality here. Little crap here. And I mean, on the ad, it's showing big, beautiful Naruto in, in his Kurama cloak. It's supposed to be something like this, you know, with some clear resin, beautiful effects on it. But at the end of the day, this is what you will get. So here it is folks, here is our little public service announcement. If you've ever wondered what you would get in those mystery boxes, all these ads from Facebook showing you a big beautiful statue like this, like your 10 bucks, we're sending you something like that, it's gonna be awesome, but it's not gonna be awesome guys. This is what you will get at the end of the day. And this one is like, this is the best one if you're lucky you get something like that, it's the best one. That is actually, for them, the best quality that they have. Otherwise, most of everything that you will get is a little tiny piece of shit like this. So there we have it, folks. I hope it helped some of you guys decide if you will go ahead and or not and purchase on those mystery boxes. If you're curious, I'm gonna for sure drop a link to the exact one that I have purchased personally. And well, you have been warned, here it is, the difference between legit, actual resin statue. Here, this one, if you want to know, I've purchased me one of the sites that I used for my pre-orders, FNC, it's a fanatic anime store, very, very reliable. They've got lots of different options, they even offer you payment plans and it's very, very convenient. So here's the difference between an official trusted reseller and some random ad on Facebook, you know, it's telling you, yeah, we're gonna send that, but at the end of the day, this is what you will be getting. So you have been warned, if this is what you're looking for, some little things like that, then I mean, sure, go for it, but to be honest, in my opinion, at the end of the day, it came to about $10 each. And in my honest opinion, I wouldn't even pay a dollar for this piece of crap. So it's up to you to decide, do you think it's worth $10? Do you think all, all of that I have received is worth what I paid at the end of the day? Personally, I don't think so. Uh, but I'm curious to know what you think about that. You can definitely let me know in the comments down below. And for now, well, this is it. What's your boy Juby just giving you, doing you a little service. If you've ever been curious about that, here we have the answer. And for now, what's your boy Juby and I'm out.